Hey guys, it's Sodi here. Today I'm very excited to be trying out the newly buffed up version of Researcher Carrot. So here's how I built her. So I basically went for an attack focused build, simply because her damage mainly comes from her burns, and the burns scales off of your attack stat. So the higher attack you have, the more damage you do with her. Aside from that, I also gave her some survivability and speed. I chose to go for Etiquette Scepter. This artifact is really good on her because it allows you to spam your S3. So yeah, very excited to be trying her out now. Um, she's been getting a lot of hype recently, so without further ado, let's get right into the Guild Wars. So I'm attacking really early today, it's 21 hours to go. Alright, firstly let's go for a tower in the Civil Monarch, so let's go for this one. The reason why I want to try this tower is because there's a FCC plus Tempest Siren plus Landy defense, and I want to try bringing my Carrot into that defense. So let's go. For the first battle, let's bring our anti-CC unit, so there's a Ceres plus f 10 -E. So in this case, I'll go for my designer Lilibet. And who should we bring? Let's go for a Rowlet Counter. So we can bring our Falconer Cleary. And who else should we bring here? Let me think. Um, designer Lilibet, Falconer. Hmm. -mm. We can bring another damage dealer, I think. We can just go for a knight right here. We can go for Crow. Um, the thing about Crow is he's really good into the Rowlet. Yeah, extremely good. Yeah, that looks good. Yeah, because we can just horse the Rowlet. All right, for the second battle. Let's bring our maid and also carrot. So we have maid, carrot, and do we want to change up our knight? I don't. I don't think so. I think FCC is pretty good. Yeah, looks good. All right. Let's go. Okay, so it's a speed Rowlet. Now, Falcon and is gonna outspeed here. So, I go for the Rowlet, I don't go for the f 10 -E. Because we have the design a little bit coming right in to cleanse. He resisted. At least he went for the crowd. It's a speed rally, so he's pretty squishy. Wow, that's such bad timing. Okay, so do I S3 or do I S1 and try and silence here? I think I S1 silence. Perfect. Got off the door attack. Okay, so right here, just one shot the rally. I don't think we need to hit here. Alright, we did 12.3k on a miss. Yeah, that's why Kraut's so good into um, into Rowlets, because you can one-shot him even on a miss. Alright, now I go for the S3. Well, good thing we landed our Silence with our S1. I mean, I could have landed skill cooldown increase with, with my S3. 3, 2, but I wanted to save the cleanse right there. So I kept it. So I went for the gamble on the S1. I think it's a 75% chance. Yeah, 75% silence. So the soul burn becomes 100%. Alright, moment of truth. Carrot. Okay, so we outsped. I think I'll S1 the... Hmm... Tempest Siren, okay. Let's go for the attack buff here. 
Ah, wait a second. I think the land is gonna get full S3 here because of the attack buff. Okay. Okay. Alright. Very nice. Okay, so uh, S1 again, I think. Resist it! Come on. Stun. Nice. See, I pushed everybody. Wow, 9.7k burn? Are you kidding me? Okay, I'm not gonna attack the T Siren. I have Eticus, that's on 87k. What? That's crazy. Holy crap. Okay, so. Wait. That's insane. Um. Okay, we have skill modifier now, so the T Siren doesn't do anything. And because of Atticus, we have our S3 up again. And also her self-cleanse basically just cleanses Keyserin's silence or unbuffable. Super good, very good unit. Yeah, I think she's legit now because of the detonate and everything she has in her kit. Let's see here. Detonate 6.4k, that's crazy. So she just deletes Landy. We didn't even need to detonate the burns. Landy just fell. <laughs> All right, next battle. Let's go for this tower. So there's a Shalf instead of Landy here. So let's try this out, yeah. So what I'll do here is I'll go for Maid Carrot. I don't think I'll bring FCC, instead I'll bring Water Crow. I think Water Crow's better here. Versus the Shelf, that is. As for the second battle, hmm. I think F10 is pretty good here. 50 50 on the Landy, but she's really good to Ella, Crow, and Kron. Okay, hmm. I think I could utilize my Rowlet here, I think. Yeah, I'll bring Rowlet. And I'll bring my Falcon Cleary again. I think Falcon is pretty good. Yeah, so we got two openers for the second battle. Looks good, I think. Is it? Does it look good? Um, yeah. Yeah, alright, let's go. Okay, that's a speedy Tempest Siren. The two of our units are on Immortality, so... I mean, yeah, Immunity. Just go for the S3 here. Alright, do I save my S3? Nah, let's just go for it. Charles is immune, but it's fine. Alright, now I S2 the... Tempest Siren. She's got two burns on her. 20k HP Charles, guys. That's very tanky Charles. Try and stun him. Resist it. Assisted the stun. <laughs> wow, it burned for 4.6k. And then I just detonate, right? Boom. Wait. Not sure if we detonate it. Um, S1 the FCC here. Resisted. Wow, well, mate's falling. Um. You're just going for my maid. Attack the shells here. Okay. Hopefully we land the provoke. Okay. 
Okay, Chalice is gonna go for my crowd, which is fine. Well, wow, it's a lot of damage. And she procs Gab here. Okay, wow, look at the barrier on Carrot. Alright. Try and... We stunned, perfect. Okay. Oh, I'm silenced, okay. Alright. So I'll take out the shells here. We're missing 22k HP. We hit, so yeah, 18k horse. Do I soul burn? Nah, let's try and stun. Alright, we have carrots S3, so do I do I soul burn this? Nah, soul burning does nothing because the syringe is gonna go into stealth. She's gotta cleanse herself, yeah. Supply defense buff here. I don't think the T Syrian can take out take us out. She propped Gab. Let, let's see it. Moment of truth. That's a lot of damage, but not quite enough. Um, I'm just gonna go for my S3 here, I think. Yeah. Apply revive buff. Alright, let's detonate the FCC. Boom, 13k detonate. That's crazy, that's two burns by the way. We did 13k damage to the FCC. <laughs> Yeah, good game. Wow, carrot man. <laughs> Crazy amounts of damage and sustain. She, she could be like a new best unit in the game. Now that I think about it, I'm not even joking. Like her, her buffs are totally insane. Okay, this is not good. We didn't land them buffable, and we did not strip the crowd. Hopefully, we land onto the landy here. And just one shot here. Okay. Yeah, that was not good at all. Uh, that F10 he did barely anything. Okay. Guiding crap. Um. I guess let's let's pop the immortality here. I mean, we have. Wow, he hits our water unit. Alright. Alright, we're definitely losing some units here, but... But we're not in a bad, too bad of a position, I think. Okay, this will bring Landy out of stealth. But she's not defense broken now, so I have to just go for her here. Hopefully we apply blind. No blind, man. Getting nothing here. Abyssal Crown, nope. Okay, going to perfect. All right, we won. All right, we get to save our units too. Perfect. Uh, Rowlet was definitely the unit to bring here in terms of the uh, the DPS unit. Right, Soul burn here and let's go for the S3. Oh, I should have S3. I, I thought it was down. He's stunned, so it's okay. Alright, good game. Uh, let's move on to the third and final match. Alright, for the third and final match, let's go for this tower. So for the first battle, hmm, I think I'll bring my maid and Carrot into the second battle. Yeah, for the first battle, let's bring back our design a little bit. I think Lilibet's pretty good. Is she though? Let me think. Um, nah, I think she's better in the second battle. Now that I think about it. For the first battle, I think I'll bring my A-Tie win. 
instead of the water crowd, just to have more cleansing because that's a series plus ammo bar. So I'll go for a Tyrant Falconer and let's bring one Arbiter Vildred Counter. Blood Moon Haste pretty good I think. Yeah, it looks good I think. Do I wanna hmm Yeah, I think this is perfectly fine. Alright, for the second battle. Made carrot and Yeah, I think the sign a little bit good because you know just in case that F10 provokes my maid, we'll have that design a little bit coming in clutch for the cleanse, so I think this is fine. Alright, let's, hmm, let me think. Yeah, let's go. Alright, we outsped the Cerise, perfect, but I don't think I go for her. Do I? No, I, I go for it. I go for her. But I was gonna cut. Okay, so right here, do I S3 here? Nah, I don't S3. Bow's immune. So A Tyrant's just gonna cleanse, yep. Okay, so... Do I go for the Cerise here? Um... Now let's just blow the S3 onto the Arby. Almost one shot him. Wow, I mean, if I had a bit more HP, hmm. Okay, so do I go for the one shot now? I go for the provoke, yep. And then now I take him out. If my ammo haste had a bit more HP, we would have one shot it. But then again, my ammo haste already has 25.2k HP or something, so. Alright, now I'm just gonna try and take out the series, I think. Yeah. Let's go for the soul burn here. Okay, hmm. Don't have to use my S3 yet. Let's take her out. Um, just go for the S1 spam here. Okay. Uh, save my S3. 20.9k HP ammo bow. Sober in here. If we land the stun, it's sober. Did not land a stun, alright. So we have to land the provoke. If we land the provoke, we're in a good spot here. Alright, it's over. Yeah, my ammo haste has 25.1k HP. Just need a bit more HP on him, but like, still gotta be difficult if I try to go for more HP. Yeah, my best HP gears are on my water crowd. He's got like. 28, 28.5k HP I think. Alright, so we resisted the F10. So, do I go for the cleanse here? Or do I save it? I think I save it because the Briseria is gonna go. And strip everything. So, I save it. Alright, let's see the damage here. Okay, so Shao's just put two burns on him, so he's got four burns now. <laughs> look at that! Look at look at Shao's. <laughs> Shao's basically took himself out. <laughs> okay, yeah, let's go for the cleanse here. Wow, that's awesome. <laughs> He took himself out to the carrot burns. Amazing. Yeah, it's gonna be, I haven't I didn't even give my carrot attack buff yet. I should have. That I wanted to see the damage there. Would have been pretty interesting. 
Detonate. Alright, didn't need to detonate that. Yeah, dang, I wanted to see a damage with the attack buff, the burn, because the burn scales off of your attack stat. If I give my carrot attack buff, she will have done more damage there. She's also pretty good into Briseria now, because we can just strip the immortality buff right, right there. But strip the immortality buff and um, Briseria's a goner. So yeah, carrot, just a superb unit, way too strong I'd say. Yeah, so that's pretty much it for today's GVG session, Maid plus Carrot. If you don't have Maid, you can go for it. other attack buffers. A similar to unit to Maid in terms of a s attack buffing support, a defensive one is DN. You can go for DN. Um, you can also go for MO Carrot if you're going for him, so let's have a look at my Carrot. So yeah, I went for a high attack build, very high attack, but I did sacrifice my survivability and a bit of speed. So next I'll be trying her out in RTA. What I'll do is I'll lower her attack and I'll go for more defense and HP. I'll probably lower her attack to about 4k-ish and I'll increase her defense, HP, speed. Speed to 200 plus, not sure how much higher I'll go with my defense and HP. But yeah, Carrot amazing unit now guys, I do highly suggest you building her, if you haven't already. She's super good into a lot of units in the meta, not just Earth units like Landy or Shout. She's also great into Briseria as you guys saw, and, and also many other units. She's got self-cleanse and maxed out her skills. It took me two days of farming, but totally worth it. Yeah, also very easy to triple S, give her the um, flat attack, self imprint, increases her damage even further. Chose to go for Etika Scepter, then go Etika, um, Book, or even Warhorn. I I've seen some people run Warhorn, so you, know, you can try Warhorn out, the guild artifact, but yeah, I like Etika. Also, I have mindset plus 24, and it's not being used, so. Super thankful I finally found a use for this artifact. So yeah, that's pretty much it for today guys. Um, oh yeah, my maid. Show off my maid one last time. Um, so yeah, maid, same build, high ER, speed, HP, defense. More so the HP defense. Um, yeah, I wanted her to be very tanky. Also, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, for today guys. Hope you guys enjoyed today's GVG video. If you did, please give my video a like and subscribe to the channel. And don't forget to join my Epic 7 Discord. The link is down below in the description. So have a great day guys. Sodi signing out.